Capacity and I'm a Cultural Program Coordinator with the City of Oshawa in the Recreation and Culture Services Branch. Today I wanted to show you how to draw insects that you can add to a garden picture. I want to draw a butterfly and a bee that I can add to my garden picture that I painted with ice. If you haven't seen my video on painting with ice, you can check that out in the description box below or on oshawa.ca. First, we're going to draw a butterfly. So to do so, I'm going to start by drawing a circle and then drawing a long oval just below it. Above the circle, we are going to draw two lines straight up that will curl around to make antennas. Now to draw the wings, we're going to make a big number three and connect it to the oval. And then on the other side, we're going to do that with a reverse number three. For more detail, you can add a face and a design to your butterfly. To draw a bumblebee, we will start by drawing a small circle and a large, wider oval to the side of it. Now we can add antennas, some wings, and a stinger by making a V-shape coming out of the right of the oval. Now we can add lines on the center for stripes and a face for the bees. Now I'm going to outline my bumblebee and butterfly with black marker and color them for my picture. I'm now going to be cutting these out and placing them on my ice paint. If you are using scissors at home, please make sure to always ask for help from a parent or guardian. I'd love to see your bumblebees, butterflies, or any other garden picture you've drawn or colored this week. For more information on recreation and cultural services, you can check out our website, oshawa.ca. Thank you and have a great day.